any you guys <laughs> I'm over here in coach but we'll be all right all right y'all so we have a problem I'm traveling with my mom and we are sitting here because uh, the place where we took our COVID test sent the wrong test for her so I have my PCR test but she only has the rapid test sent even though she did a PCR so um, it's a little bit of a conundrum we have to wait until 8 a.m. it's about 7 30 now uh, so we'll wait until 8 to call them and see if we can figure out you know what this thing is and if they can send us the email and then go from there success you guys we got the PCR test results back so we're gonna walk down hopefully um, it doesn't take that long to get there we're still like two hours ahead of time so hopefully it's okay let's see all right we made it <laughs> Do <bye -bye>. <laughs> <laughs> all right here look here do you say my what? goodbye here, here, here we go <laughs> <laughs> all right y'all so we made it through um my mom requested a wheelchair so we like zoom through that line okay um so that is the perks of traveling with a senior citizen okay you get to zoom through the line um we're gonna be waiting for a couple hours uh for our flight to actually start boarding it boards what time is it right now so it boards in about another hour um and yo like we were we were stressed okay sweating bullets like i'm like oh my gosh are we gonna make this flight but the lines were um pretty good okay uh let me take this off just just so you guys can see my face a little bit um the lines were pretty good um no like the security check-in was fine it was pretty easy and it made it easier the fact that she was in a wheelchair because like they just you know let her go through so that was cool so um when i get on the plane maybe i'll show you guys some of like the images outside the plane i don't know uh but definitely show you guys that that hotel room and we gonna get this thing going okay let's do this mm -hmm. Look 
and that that building over there is the one that you always see okay um so let's take a look at the bathroom so first we have the shower here right when you walk in on the left i always like to take a look at the shower shampoo and conditioner and the body wash that hotels give you i don't know why i mean you know you typically take them with you and i really like the fact that this place gave you two sets and they replaced it every day also there was this um kind of vanity area that they had these bottles of water at and they replaced those bottles of water every time you drunk it so it wasn't like a, oh i need to pay for this nothing like that this was the huge soaker tub that we had i never took a, a you know a bath in it but it was nice to look at and over here we had like the toilet and the bidet <laughs> y'all look at what i just found my babe dropped in here a little note so sweet love you aunt Aww. so it's private so i'm not gonna let y'all see what's in it but i'll read it i'm sure it's nice thanks babe love you thanks babe all right um I'm gonna continue to get settled in. You guys saw the room, it looks really nice. Um, I love the view, it's amazing. So I can't wait to see it at night and um, I can't wait to experience Dubai with you guys for the first time. All right, let's do this. So I just came from taking a shower and I am not saying this just because I'm in Dubai, but I promise you that was like the best shower that I've ever taken in my life. Like the water pressure was right on point. But I had to jump in the shower because literally it was a 12 hour flight from New York to Dubai and it was a straight flight, but it was 12 hours. And so 12 hours on a plane, um, it's like doing a 12 hour shift for work, right? You, when you get home, you want to take a shower. So I took a shower I'm in my little room. <laughs> um, and I am ready to have a good time. I'm like, super like I'm really really excited about this view you guys I keep looking at it. I can't stop looking at it um, let me just kind of show you guys this view BAM look at that y'all this is my view like I, of course here we have like all the skyscraper <laughs> hotels um, but this right here of the canal and just that little arch bridge and all that it's beautiful I'm excited to enjoy myself um, I showed you guys that note that uh, aunt sent me and actually like it is something that I can share with y'all like he was just really being like super uplifting let me actually go get it I'm gonna pause really quickly go get it because the lighting is bomb so I'm gonna pause go get that and come back but yeah so my babe sent me a note and he was like being really really super uplifting and so let me just kind of show you the note because it's like I mean, maybe somebody needs this message today. Um, so it said, hey, babe, just wanted to say I miss you already, which I was like, oh, I miss you too, babe. Um, he said, have fun, vlog a little, which I'm doing. Be street smart. Aunt is all about street smart and honoring God. Um, seek a godly experience and God will allow you to find it. Love you, Aunt. Matthew 7, 7 to 8. And that is my man for you, always with a word, always being uplifting. Um, and he even dropped me a few extra dollars in this note, so that was dope too. Um, so I'm gonna like see what I can do. Maybe I can bring back a couple souvenirs for him and the kids because they didn't make it on this trip with me. Um, and then you know, like do a little shopping for myself as well, and you know, of course, bring you guys on that that experience. Um, and then we're definitely going to the Expo 2020. Uh, which is kind of like a tour of the world basically um, so it has like all like I think it's 191 countries um, in the world and um, you can experience it all here in you know like the Middle East here in Dubai so it's really cool um, excited about that I you know I have to hit Trinidad up you know that's that's my home so I'm gonna hit Trinidad up and I heard that Saudi Arabia was really dope so I'm gonna do that one as well all right can't wait to have you guys come on yeah I think I might just you know, like, like kind of like sit back and relax. <laughs> and I will talk to you guys later, okay? I'll see y'all. Peace.
Look at this. Where do you want to go? <laughs> Let's go. So many people here. Look at this place. It's huge. Look at this. Look at all these people. So this so is actually people. our first night in Dubai. We decided to hit the mall up, just kind of see what was going on in um, the nighttime, and it was bananas, you guys. There were so many people. So here is called the souk, and it's actually a version of the gold souk that I would be visiting a little bit later in this vlog, so you guys just keep watching. Um, but you can buy jewelry, gold, silver, you can buy incense and perfumes. Um, and then we have here the massive 155 million year old dinosaur skeleton that was placed in the Dubai Mall. So it's like you're coming in to shop, but at the same time kind of be a part of history. It was really amazing. Guys, when I say there was so many people, I'm telling you, there were so many people. There was thousands of people at this mall and it never died down. We went early in the morning, we went late at night, close to midnight uh, when the mall closed and it always looked just like this. So this is, a, this is a section called Level Shoes, and it's just all shoes. Different designer shoes, just different shoes in general. It's all shoes. Life is short, buy shoes. Manola Blahnik, wow, this is amazing. So when my mom and I were just walking, we stumbled upon the Dubai Aquarium, an underwater zoo, which is actually located in the mall. And it's crazy because it has 10 million liters of water. All right, y'all, so day two of the trip to Dubai and um, I am about to go on like a tour of the city so uh, i think our tour is supposed to last like a few hours so that should take up the majority of the day and at some point i'm going to expo 2020 i think it's going to be tomorrow i think that's when i want to go but depending on what time sorry i just put my contacts in and woke up this morning um but depending on what time the tour of the day ends then I will ensure that <laughs> hope if I have enough time, then I'll go to Expo 2020. Okay, so that's my plan. My eyes are watering like crazy because I just put my contacts in. I just woke up. I'm gonna go like brush my teeth, wash my face, do all of that good stuff. I haven't even washed my face and brushed my teeth for y'all yet. So <laughs> I'm gonna go do that and then um we gonna go outside and explore Dubai a little bit more. You got a little bit of like the mall nightlife and then you know let's see what else Dubai has to hold. We about to go on this tour y'all
This is the gold soup over here. I just came from the spice market. One more small one? Small one. 120 This one selling 200 and 150 This one is that shining one. What this one? Alright, I'm not taking a look. So we're in the famous gold soup. This is where you can get all the gold that you want, hopefully for a good price. My mom is here on the hunt. Uh, we're about to do this thing, okay? Guys, now when I tell you there was so much gold in this marketplace, there was so much gold. And it ranged anywhere from 18 to 24 carats. Um, and the gold was beautiful. I got a little bit of gold. This is my name. So I got a little bit of gold and I'm excited. For, I don't know where we're going next, but um, of course you're going to come with me, you guys. Okay. So no worries. Um, I will definitely see you guys in a little bit. All right, so we are here. We're about to eat. Um, I got like a plate full of food. Let me show you. It looks good. And I got two salads. I'm just like being greedy and some like fruit. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna eat it all, but I'm sure I'm gonna try. <laughs> so, uh, we'll see how that goes. And look at what my mom's got. What she got going on. Yeah. Got a little bit of soup fish and, and soup and stuff. All right, Ma, see you. All right, and this lighting is bomb, so I think I might also take a picture here. I'm going to um, try some of this dessert. I have this mango and this passion fruit cake. I don't know if you guys can see this. So, mango and passion fruit. So I'm going to try some of it and see how it goes. A little bit of a layer to it. Like that. Yes, please. Thank you. Mm. It's not bad. I don't know what this is. I'm not really feeling that. It's not bad. All right, let's try the passion fruit. So, passion fruit is orange. Layer again. It's not bad. I can do without. I'm gonna stick with the fruit. Yeah. Mine was sour. Oh, the piece I took was good. So you took the good piece. Mm. My mom took my good piece of pineapple because this one is sour. On the right side, that is called Jamira Beach Five Star Hotel. It takes four to five hours to completely explore this mall, uh, this park. So 
So at this point, we had spent all day touring the city and seeing all the sights. So we were on our way back to the hotel, which I was kind of excited for because I was so tired and exhausted and just wanted to get back and put my feet up. Here we were actually able to get a glimpse of the Ain Dubai or the Dubai Eye, which is inspired by the London Eye in London right before we got back to the hotel. All right, so I'm back at the hotel. You guys can see the nice view of the hotel. Oh, wait, it's dark, so can't really see it here. Let's do it this way. You guys can see my view from the hotel. Um, I came back from the tour. It was really, really nice. I uh, had a really good time. Got to see a lot of Dubai. I feel like I'm almost an expert all of the knowledge that our tour guide gave us. And so hopefully you guys got some information from this video as I was explaining some things that we were seeing. Um, I need to go back to the mall because I have something that I need to return. I mean, yeah, I'm a tourist and I'm like right at home because I'm buying goods and returning them <laughs> uh, when they don't work, which is fine. Uh, but also I have to go to the Expo 2020. Um, I came here specifically to see that. I think it's going to be amazing. I don't know what day I'm going to do that. Maybe Sunday. Um, and so uh, tomorrow I'm going to go to church, uh, have church in Dubai. I think that'll be cool. And then from there, uh, we'll see what, what happens. Uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying uh, these videos, this, these vlogs that I'm doing for you guys uh, while I'm here on vacation. Um, and if you have like some place that you think I should visit next, let me know. Maybe I might become a little travelista. I don't know. Uh, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you guys next time.